New at six, hundreds of workers laid off at Verso in Wisconsin Rapids are looking for new opportunities. News 9's Tom Lally is in Rapids with the details. People here are really just trying to get their foot in the door. They've been laid off after years on the same job are trying to put together a new resume, deal with unemployment and navigate that job search. Right now, around 100 people still have their jobs at Verso, while over 700 go without. Looking for another option. I'm trying to find full time work. Al worked at Verso for over six years. You get your rug pulled out from underneath and you got to start all over and a lot of us are older, so it's going to be a little tougher. Like many, he's finally talking face to face with the job center and potential employers from the Air Force to public schools and dozens more. We have over 80 vendors here today participating. We'll also have a virtual option afterwards. A success sparked by local legislators. A lot of these folks who've come through here, I graduated high school with and I've known them for 30 years and it's the only job they've had and they're just, they're worried but they're hopeful. Representative Scott Krug and Senator Patrick Teston, we just want to be there as a resource, so formed the Wisconsin Rapids Working Together Task Force to address mass layoffs in the area and try to reopen that mill. Well, it's a matter of when, not if. Talks to reopen are in very early stages, but just like the hundreds looking for new jobs. Yeah, you just got to keep at it. You just got to keep at it. The Marshfield Chamber also helped today. They had it all planned out from the pre-pandemic closure of Figgies in Marshfield, where every employee that was laid off either got a new job or went into retirement. Reporting in Wisconsin Rapids, Tom Lally, News 9, WAOW.